सो ही गाइज वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल फॉर ट्यूटोरियल सो गाइज टूडे आई टीच यू हाउ टू क्रिएट सी जी आई एड्स ट्यूटोरियल एंड सी जी आई एंड वी एफ एक्स प्रोडक्ट एनिमेशन विद यूजिंग ब्लैंडर एंड आफ्टर इफेक्ट सी गाइज दैट्स माई रियली कूल डायनेमिक बबल इफेक्ट एंड सेकेंड वन दैट्स माई प्रोडक्ट सो गाइज आई शो यू माई टैक्स तो क्लिक ऑन हेयर गो टू ऑन पैक सी गाइज दैट्स माई शैम्पू प्रोडक्ट एंड गाइज आई शो यू माई रेंडर प्रिव्यू सो गाइज क्लिक ऑन फाइनल रेंडर प्रिव्यू See guys, that's my really cool bubble effect, right? So guys, now next one, I show you how to create this type of composition. So guys, go to one file and I create new project, new project check, and guys select all and press delete key. So guys, for this tutorial, I'm going to use this one. That's my add-on, A2 Blend add-on, and second one, guys, you can use JSON scrape. So guys, go to one After Effect and create composition from footage. So guys, import your clip like this. Guys, you can download this clip link in description and go to on here track and track 3D camera check. Okay, so guys, my tracking is finished and now next one, guys, select only three points like this. Adds like a flow. So guys, select only three points and now next one, right click set ground and plane origin check and one more time, right click. Create solid and camera check. Yes. So guys, go to on here preview and play. Yeah. See guys, that's my simple tracking, right? So guys, now next one, import your tracking data in Blender. So stop. Go to back. So guys, go to on here transform. Select only top four position and copy. So guys, create plane check and next one guys, go to on here and that's my camera. Top two position and guys create camera check. Yes, press zero. So guys, next one starting from one second like this. Guys, starting piece from one second. So guys, lastly double click on this camera and focal length copy, copy and go to one here and guys click on here focal length paste. Yes, that's it, guys. So guys, now click on here background image and import same clip. So go to on desktop and select and import. Yes, right. See guys, that's my tracking data and opacity 100% check. So guys, go to on back and play. Yes, right. See guys, that's my tracking. And now guys, I change FPS. So click on here frame rate change. Like a twenty nine point nine seven. That's my same frame rate, twenty nine point nine seven. So guys, I change render setting. I like circle render, and guys, same two five is good. So guys, go to one fill and transparent check. So color and I like standard. Yes, that's it, guys. Okay, so guys, my tracking data is finished, and now guys, I increase scale size. So select this plane and increase scale size like this. So guys, this time I apply product. So go to one file and append. Guys, I already create product like a shampoo bottle and select. So append. See guys, that's my product, right? And click on here. So guys, up. So guys, I apply HDR lighting. So click on here and guys, environment texture check. So you can apply any HDR lighting like this. Yeah, good. And guys, rotate this product. So guys, click on here and rotate like this. Yes, good. Right? See guys, that's my simple bottle. And now next one, guys, I create simple animation. So guys, click on here. And guys, you can change random color like this, right? See, so guys, press zero, and I create animation. So guys, frame increase up. So guys, frame select this transform and last like a three eighty nine and three eighty nine. Yes. So guys, go to back and guys select your product and guys click on here final render preview. So guys, select this flow, and I apply shadow catcher. So guys, click on here shadow catcher check. So guys, select your bottle and apply like this. Yes, good. See so guys, that's my composition. 
and guys now select this sunset bottle and guys i create animation so guys go to like a hundred frames hundred check and guys press i and location and rotation check go to and back so guys go to an up like this and press i and location check yes see guys that's a simple animation right and guys now i create rotation animation so guys select this one that's my rotation so rotation like a zero on zero one frame and check so go to on last last and guys i create animation like this yeah good and press animation key right it's good and guys now click on here and play yeah see guys that's my first rotation animation and guys now i create like a idle effect so guys like a 150 and guys go to back i take like a 12 and check guys go to like a 150 and little bit up like a 13 check so guys like a 200 frames and 12 so guys i create only this one position animation and guys like a 13 and check 300 frames and i take 20, 12 check lastly guys like a 350 and 13 yes good right see guys that's my simple animation and guys now play yeah great see guys that's my simple dynamic effect right it's my composition animation and guys next one i create this bubble effect bubble so guys stop and guys go to back and guys i create new collection so guys select this collection and this time i like guys this time this one echo sphere so guys see that's my echo sphere and click on here go to on here on out of camera see guys that's my echo sphere right and out of camera check so guys next one i create duplicates for this time guys go to on edit mode edit mode check and select all select all and press a for selection and press shift d shift d guys see that's my sphere and change guys scale size see guys that's my scaling size and shift d right it's really simple and change scale size and again shift d and again i take more spare like this and guys randomly change scale size and up yes good see guys that's my bubble effect bubble guys i create more so press one and shift d and scale size change like this more and shift d guys scale size change smaller right it's really simple and guys little bit up like this and guys you can apply more bubble effect bubbles is dependent on your work yes this is good for me and guys press zero so guys this time i apply cloth tag so guys this time select this product and guys apply collision effect see guys that's my collision so guys select your product and collision check so guys select this bubble and i apply cloth and guys i change cloth option so guys click on here rubber this one click on here three option and rubber check so guys go to on down pressure pressure i like one and guys go to on here catch it guys catch it same three eight nine enter and guys shape shape is good collision and guys self collision check quality i like five yes so guys go to on here field and gravity i like zero yes so guys play it's not working so guys this time i apply this time force field so guys select this shampoo bottle 
and guys i apply this time force field force check so guys press one and i see that's my force field go to an up apply on here and increase scale size yes right and guys select this force field so guys i create animation so like a i take like a fifth 60 is good 60 and strength i like zero check and go to like a hundred and strength i like minus 80 is good for me check yes go to back and play and guys play see guys that's my first animation after 60 frame that's my bubble effect see guys that's my really cool bubble yes great see guys that's my really cool bubble effect so guys now next one i create more smoothness so guys select your bubble and i apply subdivision surface subdivision surface check and guys i like two and two and shade smoother and guys again play yeah great okay so guys my work is really good and guys now you can apply more bubble effect is dependent on your work so guys stop and guys you can apply more so guys same select this pair this one and go to on edit mode select all press a and shift d shift d so go to on here out of frame like this yes good and object mode yeah right see guys that's my final composition so guys select this force and guys i change frame starting from 50 frame 50 and guys i like this time go to one here like a 80 80 so and i like 80 and strength little bit increase like a minus 100 check yes that's it guys so guys go to back and play right it's looking really good so guys stop and now guys i create catch a so guys select this pair and go to on here cloth so go to on here catch a and bake all dynamic check guys see that's my baking okay so guys my final baking is finished and again lastly play guys i apply this time bubble material yes guys my dynamic bubble dynamic animation is looking really good okay so guys lastly stop and delete all big checks so guys select this flow this one and increase scale size increase and same collision check yes so guys next one click on here guys that's my blender kit add-on guys don't worry it's free add-on and type bubble enter see guys that's my different different style of bubble material so guys select this one and i like this one bubble texture yes so go to on again here and guys see that's my bake or dynamic check guys my baking is finished and again play yeah guys it's looking really beautiful yes great see guys that's my final work and stop guys i show you my one frame render so guys render and render image check so guys my render is finished and now guys i create composition so guys close and composition check and guys as a same tutorial guys search and viewer and guys i like alpha over so connect this one and guys lastly search a shift a and i like movie clip so guys apply same movie clip so select and apply and simple connect yes and connect to viewer yeah great see guys that's my composition right and guys go to on again layout and guys go to on here starting and delete all big check so guys select this pair and guys little bit up so up like this yeah this one is good and guys now next one i apply light sunlight so guys go to one here yes and guys i take light select this one collection and i take sunlight so go to one up and guys little bit rotate little bit and click on here 
so guys rotate like this yes good see guys that's my sunlight and guys i change some setting so guys strength i like 1.5 and angle like a 20 yeah that's it guys so again lastly go to on here and guys delete all bake check and bake all dynamic check guys after baking you can create only render so guys my final baking is finished and guys play see guys that's my first rotate effect and guys see that's my second one and click on here so guys go to on here and again play yes guys it's really simple yeah great right and guys stop so guys i show you my render preview so render and render image check yeah great see guys that's my really cool work right okay so guys my final work is finished and click on here output so guys i create render so guys you can create only one frame jpeg you can see this render yes and go to back and render and render animation check yes that's it guys okay so guys that's it my work is finished so guys if you like my video please share and please subscribe my youtube channel and guys you can download this project file from my website free thank you